can you please elaborate on likes and dislikes for example i like dal and rice but detest a day old dal i also detest people who gossip but really enjoy going for walks in the morning to see the sunrise so if i'm correct did you mean to say is it to not have these likes and dislikes please help me with the, with this confusion no no anything which keeps you in tune with god with the higher thing that is to be encouraged that is why the whole thing is shreya mark and prayer mark anything so for example you go in the nature go to the ocean go to the mountains and see a sunset sunrise this is all the nature because what is nature nature is gift of god and ultimately swami says nature is god because there is no difference prakriti and purusha they are all same there is one you need to see first we differentiate this is prakriti this is purusha there is god this nature ultimately you realize there is no difference between nature and god the whole thing is that to enjoy to be in tune with god nature is one of the best source that is why why does our sages went into himalayas for penance they went into caves some people went to, most of the things is in the uh, rivers shore like even uh, parichit uh, was given uh, the bhagavatam and the river bed by uh, sage shuka so all these things are serene places which uplift the mind uh, because they are nature actually i remember 1994 swami told our uh, we were there about 30 40 people students and with swami in the house say so swami says tomorrow we'll go for picnic we were all excited so we'll pack early morning get up and we'll pack food and let us go and said why should we go to picnic he said <laughs> so we, each one was giving so i said swami we never and when you were anger days people said they went with you chitravati bad other places yeah. uh, we never saw that to have that kind of experience good another said swami to be with you is good or to eat everybody said swami says no when you are in nature it is just like the, that time swami took us to a beautiful uh, forest area where there is a waterfall so just when you are in tune with god because nothing is artificial everything is just the way it is god has given the trees the mountain the waterfall whereas swami said even though god is inside the house you see this wallpaper here and the chair the sofa these are all man made things so where there we are it is much easier to be in tune with god so nature that is why all the great people who are the, the monks or the spiritual seekers go to this uh, places of natural sound, uh, surroundings river ocean caves mountains for contemplate your life because that keeps us uh, in touch so there is nothing wrong those there is a, a desire but dal he was talking about dal and rice <laughs> so you can have dal and rice nothing wrong but you should not be attached if you don't have we all have the, 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 everyone i have their own thing but you should not be attached with that there is a beautiful example is uh, shidi baba when you used to go he doesn't need to be the emperor of emperors he's the lord of the universe but he used to go set an example go to bichatan that means go to house to host get and some people put put rasam some people put dal some people put uh, rice some people put kichdi and some people put pie uh, everything will be the same thing that means everything is mixed here we want to eat separately for the appetizer <laughs> then food then course and dessert but everything is mixed up so just to conquer the taste you have go beyond the taste not special uh, liking uh, for that so nothing wrong but don't be attached like i remember one swami ramkrishna or swami sahananda so he was giving talk and somebody said swami we want to bring some food so what do you like so really the swami is so gracious he couldn't answer that then he asked the people attendants what do i like that means he is such a nice even when he used to come to our house for a dinner or lunch or anything he used to put and he said i might put that money i put that and so everything mixes up and eats so this is what sanyas is so that you don't have craving for particular things so that is how this the all enjoy the thing when you can have but if you don't have we should not be miserable that is the difference between also the yogis everything they enjoy the same thing like everybody else we all, we all enjoy but they are not dependent on that so we are, if you if you don't have it for example somebody who is addicted to smoking what happens 
If he doesn't have it, he will feel miserable. He will, some people really go mad. Same thing, alcohol, anything which is addiction, same thing, food addiction or addiction to movies. Anything, if you don't have it, then they feel miserable. That means you are dependent on that. Anything, dependence is misery. So the thing is, for his answer, enjoy nature, but don't have the craving for something and we are dependent on that. When you have enjoy, but if you don't have also, be happy. That is what he says. Atma vaishya rudhe atma prasada buddhi. Then you will get that prasada buddhi all the time.